2021 has been the worst of times and the best of times. Best of times in the sense that we found ourselves advising in some of the most seminal transactions in our various jurisdictions. We are at the center of what's happening in the economy of this country and on the continent. The worst of times in the sense that we suffered terrible personal losses as an organization. We lost our beloved chairman and senior partner, Robert Lee, to this pandemic. We subsequently lost our most senior litigation partner in our Nairobi office, Evans Monari. These were tremendous losses to us as an institution, and we're still going through that grief. So taken as a whole, it's been a most interesting year. I think um, it really was a, it was a tough and an, and an interesting year. Um, the pandemic was, has been tough on everyone, and I, and I do think we're coming to a stage where uh, we're moving through it. There's been a, a, a war for talent globally, particularly junior talent in, in law firms, and, and, and we're no exception. So we've been put on guard and we're having to really think about, about what we can do in the, in the world for, for, for talent. But we feel in a pretty good place. We've attracted some, some very good people during um, 2021 and we are, we're, we're quite excited about um, what 2022 holds for us. But I think we're moving into a, to quite an exciting phase for, for Bowman's and I think our external markets are going to be a little bit more favourable than they might have been in the last year or so. We also really consolidated our position as, a, as, a, as an African firm and a leading African firm. We have adjusted our, our leadership structure, had some succession within leadership across the firm, including the exciting appointment of, of, of Ezra as the chairman, albeit in, 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 in tragic circumstances. We're looking forward. Um, we have new leadership in Kenya, and I think um, we're very well placed to look for and get on to fantastic opportunities right across the African continent. I really think that being one firm offers a lot for our, for our clients. We work together and we collaborate across borders to try and produce the best solutions for clients working in this, in this region. And we, we work very hard to try and avoid our, our own internal arrangements having Im any impact on client service and what, what's important for the client and we've developed a structure that we think really um, succeeds in doing that. We are indeed one firm, united in our diversity, both in terms of region and jurisdiction. But we're united by our talent and our common vision. Our common vision of being the best provider of legal services on the African continent. We are looking at the forthcoming year with a great sense of anticipation and excitement. We are very well placed to take advantage of the opportunities that will present themselves. We are so privileged and blessed to be an organization made up of some of the most talented people around, but who are grounded in true African values. And we have some exciting plans in the pipeline to grow some of our offices um, within 2022. We're well positioned to take advantage of the opportunities that our various jurisdictions will present to us. We at Bowman's are really excited about what 2022 will bring for us. The pandemic has been a tough period for everyone, but I feel like the sun is, is starting to shine, and I do believe that we're very well placed to, to, to really have a good year, and we're looking forward to it.